the morning office for August 7th. Let the heavens rejoice and the earth be glad. Let the sea thunder and all that is in it. Let the field be joyful and all that is therein. Then shall all the trees of the field shout for joy before the Lord when he comes, when he comes to judge the earth. Let me hear of your loving kindness in the morning, for I put my trust in you. Show me the road that I must walk, for I lift up my soul to you. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel, from everlasting to everlasting, and let all the people say, Amen, Alleluia. The Lord is my strength and my song, and He has become my salvation. The morning reading is taken from Luke's Gospel, chapter 6, verses 19-26. through 26, The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Everyone in the crowd was trying to touch him because power came out of him that cured them all. Then fixing his eyes on his disciples, he said, How happy are you who are poor. The kingdom of God is yours. Blessed are you who are hungry now, for you shall have your fill. Blessed are you who are weeping now, for you shall laugh. Blessed are you when people hate you, drive you out, abuse you, denounce your name as criminal, on account of the Son of Man. Rejoice when that day comes and dance for joy. Look, your reward will be great in heaven. This was the way their ancestors treated the prophets. But alas for you who are rich, you who are having your consolation now. Alas for you who have plenty to eat now, for you shall go hungry. Alas for you who are laughing now, for you shall mourn and weep. Alas for you when everyone speaks well of you, for this was the way their ancestors treated the false prophets. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord is my strength and my song, and he has become my salvation. The morning psalm is read from Psalms chapter 1. Happy are those who have not walked in the counsel of the wicked, nor lingered in the way of the sinners, nor sat in the seat of the scornful. For their delight is in the law of the Lord, and in his law do they meditate both day and night. For they shall be like trees planted by rivers of water, bearing fruit in their season, and their leaves will not wither, and everything that they do shall prosper. For it is not so for the wicked, they are like the chaff with the wind, which the wind blows away. Therefore the wicked shall not stand upright when judgment comes, nor the sinner in the counsel of the righteous. For the Lord knows the ways of the righteous, but the way of the wicked is for destruction. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord is my strength and my song, and he has become my salvation. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, it is now, and will be forever. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread, and forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Let your continual mercy, O Lord, cleanse and defend your church. And because it cannot continue in safety without your help, protect and govern it always by your goodness. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Lord God Almighty and Everlasting Father, you have brought me in safety to this new day. Preserve me with your mighty power, that I may not fall into sin, nor be overcome by adversity. And in all I do, direct me to the fulfilling of your purpose. Through Jesus Christ, my Lord. Amen.